Now, what about ITV? How they've decided to focus on male chest feeding while talking about womanhood. These people have lost their bloody minds. Oh. I, this is a major British broadcaster who featured a man as the face of motherhood, of womanhood, in this piece they did. And they're showing this guy with a baby suckling or attempting to on the man's nipple. This is not the face of womanhood or motherhood in any way, shape or form. It's deeply offensive. And I think it's child abuse. That is child abuse. There is no meaningful milk coming out of that nipple. And by the way, this is becoming a trend and it's deeply disturbing. More and more trans women, which is men masquerading as women, are saying they want to breastfeed. And while you could put a very bizarre cocktail of chemicals into you as a man and force some small amount of, quote, breast milk to come out, it's going to be something that's potentially toxic. There have been heart problems found in infants subjected to this. And it's all about the man and not the baby. So we're seeing this more and more. There was a guy just trying to do a GoFundMe so he could get a breast pump for one of the breasts. He could only afford the one pump. He needed the other. Mm -hmm. Asking people to help him with this. The CDC, our government agency here, is talking about this like it's normal. This should not be normalized. It's abusive. And as we've discussed before, not all, but an unhealthy percentage of the men who are doing this are doing it out of a sexual fetish, Paul, where they get off on dressing like women and a piece of it is that they get off, some of them get off on the nipple thing. This very guy who was featured by ITV with a baby on his chest attempting to suckle has other postings online with nipple clamps on his then manly chest. And we're supposed to celebrate that he's now moved on from clothespins to a, a newborn? We're not. It's sick. It must be called out as sick. And I really think we have to get back to stigmatizing this behavior as opposed to trying to normalize it. Yeah, but also, uh, 100%. But also this thing where, and, and we know this amongst, uh, you know, lots of people over the years, which is there's always that moment where you turn around and you go, well, hang on, you're supposed to be taking care of the baby. The baby's not supposed to be an accessory for you. That's exactly right. And yet people are so determined to establish their woke credentials, how inclusive they are. They are forgetting we knew about the children. That's why they're allowing children to have their penises chopped off and their breasts chopped off at 14. Uh, irreversible pr procedures that where they go sterile for the rest of their lives based on these decisions the parents are making for them at age 12 and 13. But now it's so young as babies. 